make sure to check out easyfoot.com for some cheap and reliable coins. Link in the description. Hey guys, Userboy24 here and we are back with some more how to make coins on Ultimate Team. But before we do start, make sure to check out easyfoot.com, cheap and reliable coins. In fact, if you don't get your service in five minutes or your coins in five minutes, you get your money back. So yeah, go ahead and check out EasyFoot. Also go ahead and check out App Bounty. Link in the description for both. App Bounty, use my credit code, Huseyboy24, to get 50 credits for free. So yeah, let's go ahead and check out the new tip. Of course, if you haven't seen my new series, Road to Ronaldo, go ahead and check it out. In fact, I actually use this method on that and I managed to turn 500 coins into nearly 3k with about 4 cards, 4 to 5 cards or a bit more. But yeah, if you want to know how I do it, just go ahead and just keep on watching this video. Drop a like, subscribe. For the next episode, I would want to have about around about 100 likes for this episode and I will upload the next episode on how to make coins on Ultimate Team. It seems like everybody is enjoying this so I'm going to keep it going. Right, so what we want to do is go to club items and badges. Once you've done that, going to go to gold, and then we want to go to the you know the main league. So that is the Barclays Premier League. You can go to League One, but only use PSG guys. Uh, Serie A, Bundesliga, and Liga BBVA. For this example, I'm going to use Liga BBVA. And for clubs, you can use Barcelona, Atletico Madrid, and Real Madrid. Use your top three teams in that league. Okay, so what we're going to do is go ahead and find Real Madrid for this example. And what you want to do is just go ahead and check out the max buy now price. I just checked this one quite recently and it should be about 650. And no, that one has been bought. 700 coins, still nothing. 750 coins is the cheapest buy now in the market. Right, that always fluctuates as well. I think yesterday the cheapest buy now was 450 coins and there was about 5 in the market. Pick them all up, put them on for 750 the next day. If I did that, I would have made a, quite a bit of profit as well. So yeah, as we know, it's 750 coins. Now to find out what you need to make profit, you do the cheapest buy now price times 0.95, guys, if you didn't know. And that will tell you the, I guess, the max amount for you to bid a card so you'll make profit or zero coins. Well, you won't make a loss, basically, what I'm trying to say. So yeah, what we're going to do now to the price is go to max price 150 and go ahead and search. In fact, I've already done this and it seems to have gone and disappeared but okay what we're going to do then is actually bid on them not actually 150 do not bid on them for 150 bid on them for 250 coins and this one's two days of course do not bid longer than about three hours three hours is the max and probably not even that an hour or so is probably the the best because otherwise you have to wait for so long so long and then that card is there like forever more people will see it they'll build on it and it will just work it will just won't work out for you guys okay so just what i've done here this one for 55 minutes so it's not well it's basically an hour so it's not as long like this one which is two days and make sure to bid on 250 coins because if you bid 150 the chances are somebody else will bid on that and you would have lost it 250 is a pretty good deal as well. Of course, you can go higher to about, well, around about 600 coins if you had to, and you'll still make profit because the cheapest buy now price, of course, is 750 coins. So, yeah, let's go ahead and exit out of that, and hopefully, we will win those coins and then place them or list them up for the cheapest buy now price or 50 coins below the cheapest buy now price. So, your card is the cheapest buy now price, and they'll buy yours first. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and check out another example, but let's go ahead and change leagues. And we're going to use the Barclays Premier League. Now, I'm going to use Chelsea. I'm going to see what their cheapest buy now price is. Right, 500 coins or less. Let me see if it's a good deal. Right, my coins are just going up quite spontaneously. Big word there, but okay. Right, so the cheapest buy now price is 400 coins, guys. So what we want to do is bid on anything below 300 coins so again max price to 150 search and we can bid on all of these again because of the cheapest buy now price is quite low I'm just gonna bid on 150 and hopefully I could win a lot so yeah as you can see there's a lot on the market for 150 and I just accidentally hit trade offer that was an accident but yeah, if again, if you bid on loads and loads and loads, you can make a lot and lot of coins. Again, if you bid the whole page of these Chelsea badges, you'll be making at least a K in profit. So yeah, it, it's pretty, pretty decent, I guess. 
And this, guys, is the badge technique, I guess. It's a pretty decent technique. You can use... You can, you can have as much coins as you want. You can have 500 coins, which I did previously. And I turned that into 3k using this method and some other methods, which I'll show you later on once we hit 100 likes in this episode. Go get liking. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. I hope you are enjoying this, this series on how to make coins on Ultimate Routine. I'm hoping I'm making it easier for you to trade. But before we do end it, let me just see if we actually have won any, any cards, any badges. No, not yet, but as you can see, we're winning quite a lot of them. Like this one, we have about three minutes left. As you can see, the Real Madrid one has been outbidded by 350. I don't mind going up because, as we know, the cheapest buy now price is 750. And we're going to go ahead and bid on that as well. What about this one? This one's fine. So, yeah, that's what you have to do, guys, if you do get outbidded. Just remember the cheapest buy now price times by 0.95. And that's the max amount that you have to bid on to make a no. To not make a loss. You can make zero coins or a profit. So yeah guys, hope you enjoyed it. Again, smash 100 likes for the next episode. Because once we smash 100 likes straight away, it will be uploaded. So yeah, get liking. Share this video. If you do find it helpful, just comment down below. If you're enjoying it, please do tell me. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed it again. My name's Dan, and I am out. Peace.